adding animation to the objects. Select the object that you want to animate. On the animation tab, in the animation group, click drop down arrow for more. Choose the effect from the required category. See a preview by clicking on play in the animation pane. To change, click on view the animation group again and select another animation effect. You can also click on the add animation button on the animation tab to add animation effect. Modifying the animations. Click on the animation pane button in the animation tab. Select the object on the slide whose animation effect is to be modified. The animation effect is highlighted in the animation pane. Click on the down arrow. Choose effect options from the drop down menu. Change the effect and timing setting as desired. Example, for the fly out effect, you can choose the direction from where it should fly. Change in the timing can slow down or make the effect run faster. Transitions Transitions are the special effects that add visual interest to the slides. We can also apply transition effects in slide sorter view. To add transition effects on the slide, follow the steps shown here. Select the slide. Select an effect from transition to this slide group under Transitions tab. Set the timing duration by adjusting the timing. Click Apply to All button in Timing group on the Transitions tab. Choose the slide advancement by adjusting the advanced slide setting. No more. You can hover over the tools to see a short explanation of the tool's functionality. Previewing the transition effect. After making all the necessary settings, click preview option in the preview group on the transition tab, slide timing. On the Slideshow tab, click Rehearse Timings option in the Setup group. Click the Next button when the time clock in the toolbar shows the time required for the current slide. Continue till the end of the presentation. Click Yes button to save the recorded timings of individual slides. Running the Slideshow Select From Beginning option from Slideshow tab or press F5 from the keyboard or click on Slideshow from View Toolbar. Working with video in PowerPoint 2010. Click the Insert tab on the ribbon. In the Media group of the ribbon, you will find two options, Video or audio. The video button has an upper part and a lower part. If you click the upper part, a panel will open and you will be able to navigate to a video file on your computer and then insert it. If you click the lower part of the video button, you will be given three choices. Video from file Video from website. Clip art video. Click video from file. The insert video panel will open. It will resemble the illustration on the right. Navigate to the file that you want to use and then click import. The video will be inserted into your slide screen. You can also insert clip art video. Click the lower part of the video button and then click clip art video. A new panel will open 
on the right side of the screen. This panel is the same one that is used for finding graphical and audio clip art.